Today we're playing Orcane. I want to see how Orcane is. We don't need to go long into training mode. Oh, so the special pummel just makes a puddle here, right? Ooh, ah, I see. Don't forget, always do this as well. And then forward air. I gotta get the timing down though. Okay, let's go into some matches. All right, let's see how the Orcane is. I gotta adjust to the speed, man. Oh, fuck. Mm, okay. He's too fast for me right now. At least I stuck there. Yeah, yeah. Couldn't do much there. There we go. It's definitely working better. Oh, fuck. I should move too much. Yum. Yum. Well, ah, now that did not work out. I think that was just too fast for me in the beginning when trying out Orcade. <laughs> it was just the whole time in my face. I couldn't keep up with the speed, which is understandable. I think in Rivals 1, Rano was a super pain to play against, but in Rivals 2, it's okay. That was just me, um, yeah, uh, getting overwhelmed by speed this time and trying out Orcane. But in Rivals 1, the problem with Rano was always that I only played against campy people, and that kind of sucked ass. But Rano here, they are super aggressive. I almost got the stock there. Nice, nice, nice. Maybe I was so aggressive, I should have waited. Nice! Oh, what a stock. Okay, getting better, getting better. Oh yeah, wait, uh, he has a bad ping. <laughs> okay, he has a dog in him. Literally, yeah. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> he stole the tower. I thought I had something going on there. Alright, we still got the stock though. Hey, and we won a set. Yeah! No, I wanna keep the ranked for, for Fleet, you know? And with the other characters, I'm just playing normal matchmaking for now. And Fleet is my ranked character. I'm not sure how ranked works though. Do the other characters share the same ranking or not? I ain't gonna lie, I don't wanna lose to this dude. Guys, I don't wanna lose to this dude called Dr. Pong Linus. Ah, I fucked up. Uh, probably not dead. I'm just getting all those weak hits, you know, which is not bad entirely. There we go, finally. Need more down smash. Uh. Oh, there we go. Enhanced up strong. Yeet! Did that kill their better? I'm not sure. <laughs> Ooh, hold up. I actually like the up throw. That <laughs> he got washed. Uh, I don't know what to do after the dash attack. Oh fuck, I just wanted to suck with a spike. Fuck! I pressed Type too early and then he, he got me in hit stun. Good, good. He didn't want to go into the bubbles. I covered the right side of the stage, man. Gonna make it. Let's go! Orcane is working out very well. He kind of flows for me. I don't know if that makes sense, but I never really trained Yoshi in Smash Ultimate, but my Yoshi is actually cracked. Orcane, for me, is the Yoshi of rivals. They're the same picture. 
I just pick him up and he kind of works. It's not that they are similar, not at all. They are not similar at all, but it just works. <laughs> Mr. Numa Numa, yeah. Ooh, don't hold him. Yum. <laughs> I like the death tone. It's so cute. Yum, yum. What the actual hell am I supposed to do when there's Orkane just flying through the stage with his damn bubbles? Yeah, I know. It's kind of, it can be kind of hard to play against Orkane. What characters do you think might be DLC? Let's see. They usually go more for a, a theme of having, of having animals. So you would say... If there's third-party characters, it's gonna be indie, and definitely animals as well. Except for like Shovel Knight, like Shovel Knight was the exception. But to be fair, Shovel Knight is also an armor, so uh, it could be a, a hamster, for all I know. Could have been super nasty if I hit it down here. Nice, 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 good follow-up. Out of here. That's okay, kind of play like Ivy so Nah, not at all. Not at all. What other indie games would there be as well? Like popular indie games with animals. Hollow Knight would be one. I mean, we already had Ori anyway. Um, I don't think something like Hades is gonna get in because it's a human being. Or well, not a human, but a half god. Half god? I have to adjust to crouch cancelling. Oh! No, I'm dead! Are you more consistent with ledge hogging, by the way? I didn't ledge hog at all so far. Okay, a big elephant. Let's go. That does not kill now. There we go. I think I need to do that more, like catch them in bubbles and then just grab. No, I, I want to drop it. I want to drop it. I can't kill him. Okay. F tilt. F tilt, not down tilt. At that percent. As if that was the. F what? Huh? Okay, now I'm dead. How did I survive that? There we go. Not bad. I have so much trouble against Loxodon, that's insane. Could you talk through your thought process while in games, like what you focus on? I gotta be honest with you, it's so hard to do that while playing and learning the game. I cannot do that during the game, more like uh, after the game. But during the game, it's like literally impossible. Let's go, that was so good. Just trapped him basically on the plat. That kills. Every character has so many good options. That's true, that's true, yeah. Honestly, when I'm playing Rivals compared to Smash, it feels more like you play against the player than playing against the character, you know what I mean? Because, you know, Cloud spams back air at ledge or something like that, you know? The typical stuff. But for this game, it feels like you're playing more against the player instead of the character. Still against the character, of course, but not as much as in Smash or in Smash Ultimate. Ah, that didn't kill. And now I'm dead. Man! I can't take the sword. There we go, finally. I'm dead. Mm, that should take him to us up strong in the air. That seems so true. Alright. Dead. No! Yes, yes, yes. The wrong guy, let's go. Orkin is super fun to play, Kitling, yeah. I like this little whale. Is it just me or is that the Pikachu of rivals? Tiny red, hard to hit, can combo a lot. Ah, I got him. 
Bro, whoa, 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 what the fuck? Where is Maple's downtime on the chaps? What you say? Oh fuck, I want to land on the plat. What? What do you mean, dip? We had a good thing, you stupid son of a bitch. What's your thoughts on Clarion? I think she is good. I don't know how good. I feel like that every character can do something. You can win with any character so far. And into here with your quick reminder of subscribing to the channel. If you enjoyed the arcane gameplay so far, feel free to give it a shot. And if you want to get informed about upcoming streams and YouTube videos, feel free to join our Discord server. The link is in the description. Now back to the video. Bro, my Orkan is going places right now. Bro, it's not over. <laughs> no. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Yeet. Okay. Yeah, that was obvious. <laughs> oh, you can make it? Just under the stage. Okay, yeah, that works. Ooh. Oh, that was nice. Oh, you can make it. Okay. Does the game feel similar to melee? Nah, not at all. The movement is kind of different. Of course, you have the speed of melee. Melee players, they definitely have a little bit of an advantage, but the gameplay is different. And what do you have to do? There's one mechanic that I don't like so far in this game. That's all. And that's crouch cancelling. That's like the only mechanic I don't really enjoy. Oh. Crouch cancelling? No, no, no. Crouch cancelling. Gotcha. Ugh. No, I didn't want to. I want to take. Does it just cover like all rolls or do I just attack? I probably should just attack get up. Loxodon feels like he has a hitbox every fucking where. How does it go so far? All right. What happened? Didn't he just already attack? I'm so confused with this character. Yeah, I have a much better time with fleet against him, definitely. I have no idea what I should do there. I think I said that yesterday. I always have trouble against heavies. I have trouble against Bowser and Smash as well. It's just those heavy characters that basically occupy a large amount of space. Yeah, I think I need to use more projectiles. I have to play more bitch mate. Oh, I thought it has less knockback. Oh, I want to fear. Oh, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. By the way, Isab, who are you playing in Rivals? Dead? Probably Maple, right? Locks and Force. Okay, okay. I thought it's I thought it's Maple. It's like, let's say the little red, you know? <laughs> of, Rivals. of course not a Pikachu club, but it's it's a red. Let's face it. You like Upsa? Ah, yeah. That's understandable, though. Upsa's pretty sick. Oh, God. Okay, I was cooking. Honestly, the bubbles are really good if you want to have a chat block, you know? Okay, just numb. All right, I would say I play Fleet now. That should be enough for a YouTube video. Thank you so much for watching today's Rivals of Ether video. If you enjoyed the Orcane gameplay, feel free to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I'm going back to editing now. Until next time, bye-bye.